How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. And does NordVPN have a kill switch feature is the latest common question you guys have been asking. And yes, NordVPN does have a kill switch feature. Now, if you're not familiar with what a kill switch is, it basically blocks your internet connection and disconnects it if the VPN disconnects unexpectedly. And as it says here, your internet traffic is safer when you use a kill switch, meaning that it secures your private data from accidental exposure, preventing any rare IP leaks. It's the last line of your VPN defense. Now with NordVPN specifically, uh, you do have two types of uh, kill switches. You have the regular kill switch, which I just described, and the app kill switch, which will disconnect or uh, close specific applications that you select in case the VPN disconnects unexpectedly if you don't want to use the conventional uh, kill switch. Now, as it says here, NordVPN has two versions of the kill switch feature. First of all, for Windows, as the one I just uh, showed you right here, but for Android, iOS, Linux, and macOS, the kill switch is integrated into NordVPN, Linux, iOS, and macOS apps and prompts a system-wide network lock in case a VPN connection drops. If you use the OpenVPN protocol on your Mac, you'll be able to specify which apps you want the kill switch to shut down. So it's sort of like an app kill switch. You can also enable the native kill switch feature, which is always on VPN for Android 7 or later by going to settings, wireless and network, more VPN, enable always on VPN, and this will enable a system-wide kill switch. Now, NordVPN's kill switch won't be automatically activated when you download the application, so you may need to go to the app settings to turn it on. On Windows and Mac OS, you'll also be able to specify which apps you want the kill switch to block. As I showed you right here, you can just add an application and select whichever application you'd like the kill switch to uh, close. So that's pretty much it for this video. I mean, obviously a kill switch is a very important feature to have, and and NordVPN thankfully has all of that. So if you guys are interested in NordVPN, you'll find links to pricing discounts as well as a full review in the description down below. And besides that, comment below if you have any questions, I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.